I'm live. I'm live. It's fine. I'm totally not late to my own live stream. Everything's fine. We're good. I think we, we're good. Sound is good. I'm live. Excellent connection, man. I think we're good to go. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome. Let's play some random horror games. How about that? Because that's, that's what I feel like doing. Um, you know, I nothing against the random FNAF fan game stuff. I'm definitely going to do plenty of that. But also, I mean, I haven't done like a three random games video in a while. But I figured, you know, sometimes it's so hard to pick and choose like which ones I want to actually like sit down and record. I felt like maybe this is a better way to do it. Just let's live stream every once in a while and just play a whole bunch of the ones on itch.io and Game Jolt and I don't know, maybe uh, you guys can suggest some yourself. You know what I mean? How's it going, everybody? What's up, Ashley? What's up, Smartsy? Um, Monkey God, Little Dog, Corey. What's up, Eva? Andrew, how's it going? Intimidator? Making me feel afraid. What's up, Awkward? Also very applicable. What's up, Doom? What's up, Jay? What's up, Mechanic? What's up, Yo Girl? Oh my God, you guys are kind of going nuts here. <laughs> Which, listen, that's awesome. Appreciate everyone hanging out, jumping in, saying hey. And might as well go ahead and start off with a good old classic horror game, right? You know, a very classic horror game. I don't know if I actually, hold on. Oh, no, I didn't even capture the window. My bad. Meant to do that. Uh, whoops. Where's my game capture? Let's do this properties we're gonna have to do this like every time cleanies cleanies window service i think hold on is that what this game's called yeah basically this is like the top game on itch.io right now and i don't know why so i plan on finding out why that's at least the plan <laughs> Claudetta, thank you so much for the two dollars because yes. Heck yeah. Viewer activity. Why wouldn't it show the viewer activity? Interesting. So let me just reset that. Because I want to be able to see donations just like at a moment's glance, right? There we go. Now I think we're good. Alright. Um let's play. Let's clean. And also this is a horror game. But whatever. Hello, cleaning service. I guess that's me, by the way. We have some dirty windows at home. Do a goofy game next? I feel like this is going to be along those scales. You know what I mean? We're busy during the day, but your job would be done at night. That's a huge red flag, by the way. Banana Man. Are you referring to that, like, banana game that, um, Jayski Bean made? I'll be paid up front. Heck yeah, take the money and run. You know there's gonna be ghosts involved. Am I in Arizona? Yes. This is where I live. Alright, well. Time, time to go clean some stuff. I'm here. Let me in. Perfect. The thumbnail is noodles. The thumbnail is noodles. Or at least the current is. I I might change up the thumbnail at a later date. I kind of have an idea for thumbnails. But there is a reason for noodles in the thumbnail. Don't, don't you worry. Hello. Cleaning service. Excuse you. Hey. Oh, God. This is horribly dirty. No, my car! Oh, wait, no, I'm pulling up. Oh, I'm sorry. I thought I was... I thought my car was magically just, like, running away from me. No, everything's fine. Okay. Well. Um, better start cleaning. Check tools. That, that's the plan. Use spray. Oh, is this the tutorial? Okay. <laughs> I already kind of like where this is going a little bit. Because this is Power Wash Simulator, but also 
scary, I think. We good to go? That's a clean, that's a clean window. But there is no escape. Oh, I gotcha. Okay. All right. Nothing, nothing horrible is going to be behind any of these windows. And that's totally dirt and not... There we go. We're looking good. Little, little squeaky clean right there. But sometimes it's hard to get blood off windows. So that's why we have this patented new sponge that really takes out the red. I may need a respray. Okay, well, just didn't tell me I'd have to work this hard. All right. We good? Perfect. Play Venge? Brother, I would love to play Venge again. That actually might be fun. I think I got, like, a 2.0 update, but I don't know how much, like, things would have changed. Right? I'm curious. Is the horror... Um, oh, God. Hi there. Don't mind me. I'm just cleaning windows. Am I the horror? Oh, hey! How's it going? Just cleaning windows. You teenage boy in your bedroom. Don't. Just know that I'm here. Oh, thank you. Tell Sophie you said hi? Absolutely. I will sure do that. Oops. Why is there blood on the window? Sometimes you just got to take care of business, you know what I mean? You know, blood of your enemies and all that good stuff. The water sprayer looks like spaying eyes? What? Spraying eyes. I, I do not know what you mean. What's up, Larry? Blood, why am I cleaning windows? I gotta work hard, you see. Gotta learn how to take care of myself. Good skills to have. <gasps> ah! I hate this game. This game's stupid. It's not worth it. If the spire's involved, mm-mm. Like, I've already, okay, and that's it. Like, that's, this is the scariest the game will ever be to me, right? It's really building up. Like, look, I have a whole other, like, series of floors, so I'm assuming eventually we're going to get something jumping out at us, kind of. I don't know why this has to be done at night. Maybe this is the blood of the previous cleaning service. Just throwing that out there. But the, but the people in here seem pretty unperturbed, so, I mean, I don't know, man. Maybe everything's going to be okay. Ideally. Again, just ideally. This is the fastest drying cleaning spray I've ever seen. Right? It's kind of unfair. Do I have to worry about that thing? There's a bunch of, uh, what you call them? Fireflies. I think other countries called fireflies something different. I don't remember what they're called, though. You hear that Five Nights at Homer's got an update? It did not. It did not get another update, did it? Because, like, it's it's gotten a 2.0 update, right? Did it get a 3.0 update? I don't know how I feel about that. I honestly do not know, actually. It's like the effect of the spray when it hits, it's satisfying. That I agree with, 100%. Like, a full, a full... Spray. Very, very satisfying. Eyes from the water spray. There are no eyes in the water spray. Are you mad? Did it just get darker for no reason? Uh-oh. And the lights will flicker on and off. Nosferatu, not like this. Are we, aren't they, wait, aren't they making a Nosferatu movie sometime? Isn't that, isn't that going to be a thing? Oh, wait, water bottle's empty? Oh, God, do I need more? Oh, wait, I need more. I need to refill the water. What? I must have dropped my keys somewhere in the yard. Oh, there they are. That's pretty easy. 
I guess I'll walk over there. This looks suspicious. I agree. I already got scared by a spider, so. Here it is. I can finally open the back of my truck. That's what I'm here for. Nobody do nothing. Okay. That was easy. All right, back to where I left off. I, I Part of me kind of hopes that nothing happens for the rest of this game that's, like, scary. And it was, like, just the spider and that's it. I'm sorry. Hold, um... That's a problem. Someone got in? Oh, no. Oh, wait. Am I not going to clean that? Hold on. This is problematic. It doesn't help that I can I can't see through this window. Hello? Oh Jesus. Okay. Like I'm actually a little, a little worried now. Oh my god. Okay, good. See, everything's fine. Everything's fine. The point of you man from... <laughs> yes, I am. I am the man from the window. I don't like that mask. You see that mask? That's no good. Don't think I don't know. Good, come on. Are you clean? Oh my god, what do you... This? Okay, it was fine. Oh god, look at... Check this out, ladies and gentlemen. I think this was here before the footprints downstairs. But uh, I'm here to clean, not ask questions. Whose bedroom is this? waiting for that jump scare dude <laughs> this is gonna be the craziest jump scare that you've ever seen ah! okay well found found him <laughs> wow you guys called it oh no wait no she went he went to this room and i'm just cleaning and i'm just watching what is this see that see that Shouldn't I be afraid for them? Stop enjoying your birthday. Look around. No. <gasps> He's right there. And I'm just cleaning. Am I just no nothing? While you messing with me, you're gonna kill me. That's what this is. <laughs> I I love the logic of like, eh, not my problem. I'm I'm hired here to do a job. This is a lot more clever of a game than like I've seen than like, oh no, there's a monster now, just run away. Right? You're just stuck experiencing the story. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right, six more. Six, six more. Do you know the goofy SpongeBob horror game? You know, funny enough, I did find two more. Um, I won't play them for this live stream, but I'll probably play them for their own videos. But it just so happens that I did find two more to play. Oh, God. Do you see that? not my problem then again i got paid up front i mean might as well do a good job finish this all out got to make the house look good yep there you go see perfect that's that's what i thought <laughs> am i not i love how i'm not questioning this what <laughs> i was only hired to clean the windows 
Not even the inside. I almost wonder, like, is it going to be, like, a twist where, like, I am, like, also part, of, like, I was supposed to, like, let him in and I'm also a bad guy? Like, that's the only, like, scenario that would actually make sense of, like, why I'm not doing anything and I'm just, look, hired to do a job. Not my prob. This game's going to have a jump scare? No, we're, we're going to get one more in, right? Oh, God, there's the knife. He was already here. Now, the question is, am I going to die or not? I, I, I feel like that is up for grabs. We'll have to see. There we go. Squeaky clean. Perfect. Yo, Grants Gaming. First time donating through here. I figured you'd be great ever since. I've watched you since 2015. Love your content. Yo, thanks, Grant. I appreciate that. Thank you so much. Thank you for the $5 donation. All right, I'm running out of windows. What's supposed to be in here? A ladder? I don't like how this is like blocking something off. <gasps> No, no, yeah, let's just put him up in the attic. No, this is fine. Are we, is, wait, is there a third floor? Actually, there might be a few windows at the, up at the very top. That actually makes sense. <laughs> uh, good gravy. Uh, one, maybe like two? Maybe just two. What's up, Slender? I see you. How's it going, man? Dude, I keep seeing that mask, so I don't know. Maybe this is, like, some sort of cult thing. Honestly, like, the people in this mansion are, like, the bad guys and the guy who's, like, coming in and murdering everybody. That's, look, that's just, like, the evil version of Batman. That's all this is. It's the vigilante going a little rogue. You know what I'm saying? Oops, wrong one. It can't be this simple. I, I know. That's the thing. Well, this is this is less about being a game and more like telling a story and just like building up suspense, right? That's the plan. That's like that's what the game is supposed to be, right? Which he he took off his mask. He took off his mask. Do we get to see him? I don't, I don't know if I like this build-up, man. Okay, all right, easy. Easy, please. <laughs> please. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, 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 what? What? Is this a cult? Hold on. Wait. I shouldn't have to worry. No. <laughs> no, thank you. Please, God, no. Please, no. Oh, God. Oh. Oh, God. Wait a minute. It's actually kind of spooky. <laughs> Dude. <laughs> oh, God. Oh. <laughs> oh. We need some window cleaning at home. Are they just sacrificing cleaning window people? What the heck is the point of the Oh no, and then they use the blood. I was right! Wait, I called it! Hold on, I called it! That was actually kind of cool. I see why this is so highly rated on itch.io or like why it's at the top. That's actually pretty fun. <laughs> 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 That's, oh, Intimidator, thank you so much for becoming a member. Rest in peace, window cleaning man, brother. He is so done. Oh, my God. Dude, that was, that was something. Oh, man. What the hell just happened? Good question. We're going to move on now. I'm actually going to get the next one started up here.
if I can get to it. There we go. Little game capture action. Oh, if I can get to it. Wait, where is it? Is it not? Does it not recognize it? Here, I'll just do, uh, I could just do display capture. Bam! There we go. Uh, that is fine. Can y'all hear it? Can y'all hear the game? Can y'all can y'all hear the game? It's like super. I mean, it's super soft. What is Halloween? I don't know. I think it's like a Michael Myers fan game. I saw it. And I was like, eh, why not? Here, I'm gonna here, I'm gonna play. Oh, there you go. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's a, oh, there's another, oh, there's a Halloween 2 Asylum? Okay, well, maybe. If I like this one, then maybe we'll consider that. Okay, so, okay, you can definitely hear it, so that's for sure. Michael Myers, baby. Oh, gosh. Oh, so this is very involved. <sighs> Gotta put my coffee down. All right, here we go. Answer the phone. Oh, I do hear a phone in the background. Okay. Take that flashlight, though. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Hello, child. What are we reading? Oh, you're just watching TV, but also staring not really at the TV. Uh, hello? Okay. Spooky. Yeah, maybe I do have to turn it up. Yo, uh, yo, girl, thank you so much for the uh, donation, $2 donation. Hey, Sam, first dono, be happy, stay happy. Heck yeah, thank you so much, appreciate it. Hold on, for this one, I will um, raise it a little bit. There we go. How about that? Hopefully that's a little better. All right, Timmy, go to bed. What a very compliant child. Ah, close the windows. Probably a good idea. Why do I just have them open? It's a terrible idea. I mean, I'll do that because it makes sense. Timmy's half my size. He's a growing boy. He's been eating his Wheaties. All right, it's all fine. Timmy, Timmy, can you sleep normally? Hold on. First of all, your eyes are open. You're just kind of like laying down on the bed. You're not even under the covers. Take off your belt. What? Timmy. Oh, Timmy, you you and your stupid play giraffes. Okay. All right. My, my, okay. My child. Apparently he's got some stuff going on. Excuse me? Oh, door's locked. Or is that someone, like, trying to get in? There you go. That's better. Uh, I'm sorry. What other windows do you want me to shut? It's a very small house. Not sure what else you want. <gasps> Found him! Good thing I shut the windows. Do I not want to question that? Oh, shoot. <laughs> Restore power from the basement. Okay. Yeah, this is no good. I'm not even in a good position. Uh, where's the basement? <laughs> you want to run that by me? Wait, this is actually kind of spooky. Wait, the basement. So the basement's got to be over here, right? No? Do I need a key? Like, oh, I think it wants me to search for keys. Timmy! Go to your room! The 
this child. <sighs> Timmy. Wait, did Timmy have a crowbar? Did Timmy have a crowbar? Timmy, come back. Don't go to sleep yet. Why the hell? What, Timmy, why the hell do you have a crowbar? Timmy, we don't even... Timmy. Timmy? Timmy? Tommy. Your name's not Timmy. Tommy. Tommy, f f number one, where'd you get a crowbar? We don't own a crowbar. Number two, where where did you go? Plot twist. Timmy, Tommy is Michael Myers. Claudetta with a $2 donation. Thank you so much. Have I heard that there's going to be a Zardy's Maze too? Yes, I did hear that. Uh, it's been in production for a little while, so I'm expecting some uh, good stuff. What if what if Tommy went to the basement? No. Tommy, what what do you what do you want, Tommy? Clean up your soda. Is this one of those horror games that really doesn't give you a direction? It's just like, yep, you just gotta keep moving until you find what you need. Oh, there's a key. Nice. So this should take me to the basement. Uh, four. Wait. The key doesn't belong to this door. Okay. I, I feel like my door should just kind of be open. It's just like the front door that should be locked. Okay. What is this? Oh, got bullets. Oh, okay. I mean, I guess this makes sense. I'll take that key, though. Tommy? Tommy, where did you go? Okay. Uh... No, this has to go to the basement, then. No? Wait. Yo, Shayla with the $2 donation. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. Hope you're having a great day as well. Thank you so much for the $2 donation. Is that the lock the front door? The key doesn't belong to this door. No, that's fine. I just... What... What key does it go to? Or what door does it go to? Not Tommy's room. Doesn't go to this one. Doesn't go to this one. What's the horror game called? This one's called Halloween. Oh, there. <laughs> Tommy. Um, I don't think Tommy had a crowbar. That's a giraffe. So, never mind. That's fine. Tommy, Tommy can just hang in there. I'm sure it's fine. There you go, buddy. Um... Star Wars, nice. Actually, wow, that's... that That's my mouse pad. <laughs> go figure! Which, wow. Well, there you go. That's a quinky dink. All right. Um, brother, I just, I just want either a new key or a door to actually use my stuff on. Timmy, hold on. Can I interact with you? Let me get down on your level. Hey, buddy. You, we we got to take you to the hair place. We got to get you a haircut. All right. Because this whole side part where half, like, like your left side is bald. But then we got this, like, interesting beaver swoosh from, like, the 1910s. All right. Oh, Tommy, what are we going to do with you? I do not know. Oh, you know what? Maybe, maybe, um... My key goes to a drawer. Like that? That is a lock. But it won't, like, interact. All right, whatever. Oh, the game. The game is being a little silly, I think. Oh, here we go. Nothing. What? I have, like, nothing in my closets? We're really going the minimalist approach, aren't we? Um... I, brother, I don't know, man. Um, it, 
is there something else to interact with or Michael Myers outside is going to be like, what, what is taking her so long? Come on. How does that not work? I mean, it makes sense for there to be four locked doors and four keys, right? So, um, I'm not going to hover too long here because, I mean, you know, when you, when you deal with indie games and just games that are just, you know, just kind of throw away just fun free games, you never really know what quality you're going to get. That includes, like, completion of the game. Um... Dude, I'm, yeah, I'm, I'm stuck. Because if the key doesn't go, like, I have a key, but I can't use it on anything. Like, not unless you're, like, going to give me, I can't even use it on the front door. Hold on, let me, let me try it. Can I leave? Key doesn't belong to the door. Why don't I have all my keys in, the, in one place? It, it's game mechanics that are, like, why don't we just have the doors? Finding keys is not fun. Just have the doors be open. For me to explore. And if you if you want to block me, just say, I don't need to go there right now. And then that's that's all you need. Nothing in there. Oh man. Hurry up already. What 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 do you think I'm trying to do? What do you think I'm trying to do? What <laughs> hurry up. As if I've known where, like, the, this magical hidden door or this random key. There's a key hanging next to the door in the kitchen. In the kitchen? Wait. No, there is not. You liar. I mean, that would have made sense. There's a key hanging next to the door in the kitchen. Do you mean right here or somewhere else? Not even here, but that's more of a coat rack. Just break the door down? I, brother, at this point? I mean, I would have assumed that, like, Michael Myers has just gone away. You know? Yeah, hold on. That's a, that's a good point. Maybe I'm hanging on to another key. Because, like, it says that I only have key number two, and I've used key number four. No, those don't work. Yeah, two's the only one I can use. I don't know. I don't. Part of me, I'm I'm stuck. I don't want to. I want. I don't want to sit here forever for like another fifteen minutes. So I think we might just move away and just like play something else. Cause, like this game has, you know, it's 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 just like a throw together game. The other door in the kitchen, brother. I hope you're right. Hold on, we might be onto something, brother. Why? If that, hold on, I'm going to be really mad. If that key goes to that door, I'm not going to be happy. Would you look at that? I got key number three. Why? Brother, why do that? Why give me, just give me a key. Just give me a single key. If it doesn't matter, who the heck cares? Why am I going outside anyways? This is a bad idea. Is this it? No. Oh, I have a cellar. Okay. Wait, is that how I get in? Hold on. It's got to be in here, right? Oh, my God. Key number two. Thank you. Yes. Into the abyss. I mean, I just unlocked it, so Michael Myers can't be down here, right? Heck, yeah. Don't do nothing as I turn around. Don't lock me in here anyways. Don't think I don't hear... Michael. Michael. Michael, hi. Hey, how's it going? Am I supposed to juke you? Oh my god, I am. Wait, hold, Michael, Mike, Michael, we can talk about this, can't we, Michael? Michael, B Big Mike, Big Mike! Oh, gee, oh, oh, I, oh god, what the hell happened? Okay, well, Tommy! Tommy! Oh, I can sneak around? What, 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 what? Okay, Tommy, 
Time to go. Alright, come here, Tommy. Oh, okay, you... Here. Stay in the closet. Like, are we good? Like, what? Kill Michael Myers? Kill Michael Myers? That's my objective? Oh! God! Okay. But I need... I probably need more keys, then. Right? I need more keys. But where would another key be if I pretty much... Oh, God, blood. Um, is that my blood? I know you're down here. Okay, I gotta get some WD-40 on these stairs. Um... Oh god, I've left a trail of my own blood. Oh, that's not good. Ah! Oh, Michael! Oh, Michael! <laughs> you've, you've seemed to have followed the blood stain better than I left you. Hi. Um, I'm curious. I'm very curious. It's a video game. I'm just gonna let this happen. Oh, you're just gonna... Okay, Michael. Michael. Oh god, I've gone to heaven. Try hiding in the basement locker. Oh, thanks. Like this? Like this? Like this? Nice. Big plays, man. Maybe turn off the flashlight. Ooh, hold hold my breath. How's it going, Michael? D don't you dare freaking... Ch you better back off. Michael. I get why the closets are empty now, by the way. Michael, he... Oh. Hi. Well... No good, huh? Okay, alright. <laughs> I, I, I guess I started too early when I was holding my breath. I'm assuming that's what happened. Let's try it. Oh, there's a freaking key. There we... Michael. Michael? Be stupid. Be dumb. Oh, you're real dumb. Oh, you're dumb! Now, turn around. I'm running out of breath. Thank you. Okay. We good? Alright. So, I get it. Now, I gotta sneak around a little bit. I gotta get back into the house. Okay, he just walked around there. I wish I could, like, jump in here. Can I, like, hide in bushes? It would make sense. He's inside the house. Michael. Michael! Oh, God! Jesus! Mike, that was that was sneaky, dude. Wow, I that's actually impressive. Key doesn't belong to this door. What door does it belong to? Thank you. We are going to really quickly look around. Yes, sir. Mm-hmm. 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 Michael. Michael. Hey, buddy. Reload? No? We good? Michael. You require multiple shots. Got it. Okay, my bad. Do I have to find more ammo? So I thought I did. I thought I did good. Oh, my God. You're starting me off here. I mean, I guess this is a fair cutscene. Or, like, it's a fair area to stop.
Red Dead Redemption Halloween Edition. Yeah, basically. There you go, buddy. There you go, you big dumb AI. Bunny Graveyard? I know. I, I've been I've been holding on that. It just a lot of games keep coming out and I want to play them. I put Bunny Graveyard on the back burner. But hopefully I'll get to it eventually. That is the plan. There's a shotgun on the bed. It I I saw what you saw, but that isn't a shotgun. That's just like some of the uh, bedding is just ruffled, and it looks like a gun. It's not, though. I, I did see what you saw, though. All right, I need Michael. No, wait, that was Jason? No, it's Michael Myers. Jason's the one with the hockey mask. I don't really trust this. Michael? You're not hiding again, are you? Okay. I feel like that's something Michael would do. Big plays. Big plays. Huge plays. Enormous plays. Tim yeah, Timmy's still in the closet. That's fine. Timmy can Timmy can stay there. Oh god, it's back here. We're just gonna... Oh, God, can I not hide here? Wait, wait, wait. There we go. I kind of wanted to come over here and then leave, and now I got some time to work. Because I want to explore this room a little more. I saw I saw the gun. I thought I was going to be like, oh, game over. But apparently, we need to collect... More ammo? Hey. Am I Okay. What? Wait. The gun doesn't teleport, does it? No, there it is. Okay. I God, I hold this weird. Um. Okay. Let's do this, buddy. All right. There we go. Reload. You take more than two hits. Okay. Well, that's... Wait, wait, wait. I already have... I'm good to go, right? Wait, wait, wait. You walk through the walls. There we go, baby! Oh, God! Yo, oh, he's still alive! How? God, Timmy, run! Timothy! Jesus! Timmy! Oh, God! Timmy! Oh, that was easy. God, Timmy, did you do this? So I appreciate it. Look, that's fine. Let's go, big boy. Let's go, big boy! Come on, big plays! Oh! 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 Oh, baby! Maybe I shouldn't have wasted that many, like, ammo things, right? Police? Yes. Timmy, I love you. Wait, are you still back here? Ah, Timmy! Oh my god. You scared me. Timmy? I I hate you so much, I, I keep getting your name wrong. It's Tommy. But I, don't, I did it, okay? Jesus. <laughs> Claudetta with the $5 donation. Am I going to play Choo Choo Charles Nightmare Mode? I don't, I don't think so, but I mean... But hey, thanks. I appreciate that. I probably not, though. I don't know. I might. I, I do like me some Choo Choo Charles. But I do hear, like, in the nightmare mode, like, you can, like, if you die, it just, like, resets you, right? Completely. So you have to, like, be bringing your A game, you know? Uh, let's see. Where's my, where's my thing? There it is. All right. Well, that was a game. 
Oh, good gravy. At, look, at least we at least we got there, right? At least we we made it there in the end. That's all that matters. Let's see. Let's let's pull out another game. Oh, let's play that. Uh, let's play the noodle game. Hold on. I might as well, you know, make sure to squeeze in the noodle game, right? It's not the noodle game that I played before. So like a long time ago, like a year and a half, I played a noodle game that honestly I do not remember the name of the game. But this is not that one. This one's called Boil Noodles at Night. And if you go on the itch.io page, this one is also up there. I think it like at one point it was number one on itch.io like a few weeks ago. And I was like, I want to play this game. I don't, I don't really have a good reason why. Oh, it even has an about this game. Hold on. If it'll pull up. Oh, it's just thanks for downloading this game. It was made by a student who's 16 year old. Okay, so I look, I know this is going to be a goofy game already. I hope it gives, look, I hope it's like good goofy. You know what I mean? Because a lot of people have been, like they've had this thing where it's like they want to brag. Actually, hold on. There it is. Hold on. I want to get rid of this. People want to brag nowadays that like, hey, I'm only 12 years old and I made a horror game. At one point, I would have said that like, yeah, that's pretty cool. But now, I don't know. It's just used so willy nilly for like subpar games. Oh, now I, is that what I need? Wait, why the heck, why the heck is it not letting me um, actually capture the window? Wait, but actually, though. What? All right, we're going to have to do something real quick. Let's get rid of this. Let's get rid of this. This. Uh, let's keep that up. Get rid of that. Settings. And, yeah. Like, I don't mind. I don't mind having, like, um, display capture. But I'd rather not. Like, I'd rather, like, hey, or capture, well, game capture. What if it's window capture? What if, what if that's what we need to do? Window capture. Yeah, there we go. That's, that was my mistake. That was my issue. All right, found it. Good. We're good. We're good to go. Boil noodles at night. Don't do it. Don't you dare do it. Yo, Andrew with the five gifted memberships. Thank you so much. Appreciate that. Hey, those of you who get memberships or decide to become a member, um, you get some uh, um, little fish badge emojis. And I have emojis, well, fish badges next to your name whenever you like comment or anything. Um, and then you also get uh, cool emojis to use, which I think there's more I need to create. Like, I have space to include more emojis, so I need, I need to do that uh, sometime. But, yo, thank you so much. I appreciate that. All right, let's, let's boil some noodles. Let's have some fun there. Or let's not boil noodles or whatever. Uh oh, is it not gonna is it not gonna show off the boiling actual noodles? Wait, it's not showing it. Really? What? Why why is everything dumb? Properties. Okay, I think we'll just have to go display capture because it's being silly. There we go. I can't sleep yet. Maybe eating noodles will make me sleepy and go to bed. I broke the game. I broke my streaming software. I want to boil some noodles. Hope there's still some noodles left in the kitchen. Definitely a bit of a bachelor home. Why do I just have a flashlight on me? Who Who is this? I, okay. Why question anything? What? It, what? This is either a flower print on my refrigerator or I'm a serial killer. Hey, look, noodles. Just one noodle? Oh, just one single noodle? This won't fill me up. I want to buy more noodle. I, I, I kind of hope that the grammatical errors are um, pur purposeful. Because if they're purposeful, we're in for a goofy time. I want to go right. Oh, thank you. Appreciate it. Appreciate myself talking to myself. Right. 
Oh God. Okay. I I'm guessing this is correct. Yes, it is. Okay. Want a sprite cranberry, dude? I I feel like that that's a meme that lasted a little too long, and I'm a little surprised that it didn't come back. Is this where I buy noodle? Hi, what do you want to buy? I want to buy noodles, sir. Noodles? The noodles are gone. Okay, thank you, sir. Ah! You, you, do you have eyes? Kind of. Do you, you don't really. I'm just going to let you. Oh. <laughs> what is your head? Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay. I'm I'm sorry I broke your head. I'm going to go now. I can't go that way anymore. So I will go back to the house. Because I only have one noodle. Nothing? Okay. This is noodles. The, the things I'll go through for noodles. The noodles are gone. Well, I want to boil just one. Onyx, thank you so much for the two dollar donation. Loving the stream so far. Appreciate it. Thank you so much. That's fine. I'll boil a single noodle. I I have two noodle. What? <coughs> God, noodles. This is this is weird. Noodles. What? Why are there two noodles here? I don't care. I wanted to, to cook it. I want to put water in the pot and boil noodles. Okay. I forgot to buy water. There's no water in my house. I want to buy water. So I guess... I guess I'll go and leave my door wide open and go buy water. This is... I don't know how to feel about this game because <laughs> I'm enjoying myself, but all for all the wrong reasons. Hey, if you say the water's gone, can I buy water? Oh, buy drink. It's only $1. I apostrophe TS. It's only $1. Okay. I got water. Where's your friend? Friend? Who? The person before. He said you were his friend and live with you. I just live alone at home. I don't know him. You live alone at home? Yes, I'm new here. I don't know anyone. Do you want to be my friend? Oh, Jesus. Do you like noodles? Is this your way of being my friend? Okay. All right, well, you're an owl. <laughs> my God. I just, I just wanted to check that real quick. Do a little quick 360. He passed the test. All right, well... If he teleported again, because I, I figured, like, that's the dude who, like, gave me some noodles. But I guess he's already here and helping to cook the... Can I close the door? Yeah, I can. That's probably safer. Cook the noodles, right? There we go. Get some noodles. Now I'm cooking noodles! Yeah, I'm cooking some noodles. <laughs> this is, like, better keep flipping the noodles. Hold on. I'm just... I'm, I'm going to ignore that and just keep flipping some noodles. Because here's the thing. Apparently, this game has three endings. And I'm kind of curious. This... But this isn't how you cook noodles, by the way. It kind of looks like I threw a sponge on top of some rice. Or like an egg. I need a chair to sit and eat. From... From the pot? Um... Oh, okay. Then, uh, where'd I put the chair? 
Where would you like me to put the chair? Oh, I guess that makes sense. I need a plate. Thank Yes, I, you don't have to walk me through all this, right? And now the noodles. Just unseasoned, just nothing. Where did the egg come from? See? Oh, it's time to eat. Maybe if there's a juice drink, it will look good and better. Just eat it or buy... I'll... I'll just eat it. I'm very hungry. I want to eat now. And it's so late that I'm tired of walking there. What? Am I going to bed with the food? What? Am I... Or eating? Oh, uh, oh. Mmm. Now go to bed because I'm full. You eat noodles, and your stomach is very full, and you sleep very well, but the next day, your stomach hurts. And that's the good ending. Um, okay. Um. Let's, let's get the bad ending I get. Like, dude, what? <laughs> okay, let's, let's just, let's go make, let's go cook some noodles again. Maybe we'll answer the door this time. Just my friend wants noodles, right? Ugh. I don't know, man. It's like, oh, I woke up and I had a stump. <laughs> I woke up and I had a tummy ache. Good ending. Oh, God, the horror. Yo, no. Good God. Why? Oh, the humanity. Oh, just give me the noodles that don't exist. All right. Oh, hey, okay. You, were you scratching your butt? Rude. Okay. Whatever. It's non-existent noodles, man. Have you played My Eyes Deceive? I have not. Maybe that's something I'll pick up real quick. Maybe for the live stream, because after this, I was just going to, like, just click whatever on itch.io. What? Noodles? Oh no, I forgot the water. I guarantee you this is a college dude that has nothing in his fridge. Ask the magic conch shell for a billion subscribers. <gasps> my like my my foot touched a tissue and it felt weird. Sorry. I was like, I don't I don't know what that is. <laughs> Everything's fine. Be careful with eyes deceive. It's incredibly disturbing. If it if it's that if it's rough, I don't know, man. There he is coming out of the woods. Alternate ending the noodle cooks you. I think that would be the ultimate ending, quite frankly. That should be ending number 3. Not the best for this channel to play it. Uh, what themes does it use? My eyes deceive is way too real. I, I hear you, so... Okay, all right, all right, all right, all right. So maybe maybe it's not the best for, like, a live stream just in case I have to, like, you know, handle something. Someone's at the door! I should answer! Hello? Okay. Hello? Nobody? All right. Let's keep cooking some noodles, man. Don't mind me, brother. 
Yeah? Do I have to keep stirring? I don't care. Closet? No. Go to sleep? Go to sleep while the noodles are boiling? You sleep when the stove is on, your house is on fire, and your body is scorched. Oh, I found the secret ending. I see. Okay. Okay. Gotcha. So, okay. And I, I was curious if, like, opening the door would actually give me something, but it did not. So, in that case, I will just... Okay, we're, we're, we're going to get that third ending where all I do is... Um, have a drink or like go back to the store for like juice at least that's the plan oh the horror yo what's up legend how's it going dude nah stream's going great thanks for stopping by we're just playing a really bad horror game about noodles which arguably it's more about a college guy who just can't get it together um, <laughs> it's, I don't know. It's a scary game, dude. I don't know if you can handle it. Yeah, whatever. I don't care about you. He is coming out of nowhere. Like he is coming out of the bushes. So I'm pretty sure that's where that guy lives. What's up, Sandra? I see you. What's up, Alex? What's up, Gustavo? Happy Easter. Brother, it's November. <laughs> uh, noodles, where do they come from? Or oh, whatever. Oh no, I forgot to buy water because I don't have a sink. Oh goodness. Don't get me wrong, I love me some noodles, dude. I, there isn't really like a good noodle place near me. Unfortunately. Well, I like I live in the middle of Arizona, which is known for the desert and not necessarily its seafood. Um, you know, I seafood is like one of my favorite cuisines, so it kind of kills me not to have like access to like like constantly good sushi or or like sushi that's near me and like not incredibly expensive, you know what I mean? How's it going? Just come out of the woods. Can I go to your home? Oh, kind of. I smell a foul odor here. Yeah, the dude's just, that's his poop area. That's what it is. Why couldn't he put in water from his sink? So the story is here, the explanation is, oh, I have to go buy water because I don't have a sink, which, all right. Like, it's it's not a good house, unfortunately. Go ahead and close that. Water. Use, use, uh, boil the water. What? Who's there? What? Nobody? That's crazy. Whoa! Don't mind me just cooking. I was boiling some ramen. Aj? What's Aj? A W W J. What is that? All good? Perfect. Uh, chair to sit and eat. Take that place here. And place that here. And it's time to eat. Maybe a drink will be better. But now I want to go buy a drink. Because that's going to be the bad ending. But who knocked on my door earlier? It's late and quiet. huff -a -fa. I do not know. I want to buy a drink. Hello? No one? All right. I'm, I'm expecting something big here to make this game. Like, so, so far, this game is not worth it, right? But I'm hoping the bad ending 
is worth it. And it's not the predictable ending of like, oh no, the guy who said he's my best friend kills me and that's it, right? Give me something. Give me like a giant noodle that comes out of nowhere, right? <gasps> he's gone. What happened? <laughs> Want to buy something? Who are you? Where's the man in the white shirt? Him? He's behind you. He's not behind me. Sir, he's... What? What? He... I, I'm so, okay. Hold on. Hold on. Oh, wait. Hold on. Excuse me. He's behind me. Isn't that the part where, like, I look back and I look back here, like he's not there, and then he gets me? Let's yeah. Let's check the bushes. That I can't really access. Oh, God. Okay. Um, can't go that way. Um, are you going to let me go back to my house? Like, what? Brother, what do you... Um, goodbye. I, what? 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 <laughs> um... It doesn't make sense for me to go back for like behind me. <gasps> he broke in. Are you stealing? Are you stealing my? <gasps> you were killed and made into a packet of noodles. Just like the previous victim. <laughs> got noodled. <laughs> Brother, you just got noodled. <laughs> um, I'm not sure what the point of that game was. I don't know. <laughs> what? Wait. Because why you had some random dude living in the bushes who decided to take over the store, but the store owner was the murderer? Who turns people into noodles? This is one of those games is like you don't need you don't need a good ending and a secret ending. Those are stupid because nothing's there. Just end it at the bad ending, right? Because that's that's what we're here for, right? Oh my god. Boil noodles at night. What the heck kind of game? <laughs> uh listen, alright. No, it's fine. Like that's the point. I'm I'm supposed to be playing a couple stinkers, you see. Oh man. All right, let's see. What else? What else could we play? A week at Javier's. A week at Javier's would be better suited for like Five Nights at Freddy's night, right? Like when I'm playing some Five Nights at Freddy games. So you have to remind me then. Ah, uh, let's see here. Um, what 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 looks interesting and scary, or maybe not even scary. One week at X. Look, listen, if it's FNAF related, like I have other nights like um, geared toward it. My God. Crowded and followed. Is it on itch.io? Let me check it. Crowded and followed. Or crowded followed. I kind of like this. This has an interesting look. This has a real cool look to it. Hold on. Legends coming through 19 days ago. Yeah, this is new. So... Legend coming in with a suggestion. I like it. All right, let's check it out, man. I'm going to be honest. I like where this is going. Let's 
extract. There we go. What's up, Angela? Angela. Angela. I read it as angel, so I had the wrong inflection. Sorry. Tiki Tiki. Oh, that's right. Wait, how long is Tiki Tiki? I saw like Markiplier played it, but I didn't see like how long it was, but I have seen it at itch.io too. You may Niki. I'll have to I'll have to see. What's up, baked bread? Not too long? Okay, cool. Yeah, I mean, like, look, I, I plan on continuing to live stream for like another hour and 45 minutes. Like, we're good to go. Um, so that's fine. Man, it's taking a taking a minute to here. While while it uh, downloads that, I'll look up Tiki Tiki. It's the demo, right? A short horror game based on the Japanese legend Tiki Tiki. This doesn't look right. Uh, where is it? I feel like I've seen a better... Uh, screen of it. Am I wrong? I am seeing other games that I definitely want to play. So hold on, let me download. There's a game called Greg's Deadly Draft. And it looks goofy. A night. Oh man, this might be its own video. We'll see. If we have enough time, maybe we'll check out Greg's Daily Draft. Um, maybe Markiplier has like a link to it. Hold on. Yeah, but I think we're good to go on Crowded Follow. Hold on, let me see. To spell it wrong? Yeah. Take a take a. Hello, everybody. No, no, Markiplier. Not, not, not today. Support the channel. Subscribe. Oh, do you not have a link to it? Nuts. Okay. Um, dang it. Where is it? Okay. I'll go back. I'll go back to look for it here in a minute. Let's go ahead and, uh, let's go ahead and load up crowded followed. Oh, wait, no, you just, you just sent it to me. Oh, Jesus. Okay. Hold on. Got it, Andrew. I got it. I got it. Awesome. I was able to pull it. All right. Now let's see. It'll be nice to me. Nice. Uh, will you game capture? Will you game capture? No, but will you window capture, you see? Oh, you will. You will window capture, but I don't know if you're going to... Mess up on me. I just sneeze. <laughs> oh my god! Everything's fine! Display crowded followed. Let's do it, man. Sure is cold tonight. Uh oh. Except no, we got it. Now we just gotta stay on display capture. That's yeah, because it's gonna be it's gonna be rude. Oh, it's nice to get out of that subway every now and then. Things tiring, sitting all day, asking strangers for a change. 340 is all I got today. Not much, but should keep me going for now. I must try and get some sleep soon. <laughs> ah! Jesus! All right, that's no good. What the? Another shooting. The city's getting out of hand. Should probably have a look. Why? Don't have a look. Like, really, this is none of your business. This is all about survival, right? Ah, jeez. No, no. This ain't good. You. Listen. You gotta take this. Please. Don't let the case. Be careful of my... It... Be careful, it might take the form of someone else. What? I'm sorry. It's here. Do you see it? Only we can see it now. You need to get out of here. Here's a subway down the alley. Get to the last train. Now, do it. Oh, God. Where are you coming? Oh, Jesus Christ. All right, time to go. Oh, no. All right, we got a spooky, spooky premise going. 
Yeah, so basically just get into the crowd and just get out, right? Oh, God. Okay, well, there's, like, all my money. Hi, request ticket. Yeah, I'm good to go. I got 20 cents left, baby. Uh, who the hell was that? Luckily, I was able to get to the last train. I'll get off on the last stop and find somewhere to rest up for the night. What's so important about this case? I've already tried opening it, but it won't budge. I'll try to force it open when I get the... Wait. Where the... Where did I put my ticket? I must have dropped it when I was running away from that creep. Hold on, let me fix something real quick. There we go. I'm gonna need to get to another... Right, wait, I need... I'm gonna need another to get through the exit. I'm a bit short on funds right now. That's followed me, oh god! How can no one else see it? It doesn't matter. I gotta get out of this situation. Oh, uh, okay. I was about to say, everyone just stay in the same place, please. Oh god. Oh wait, I, I, I get it. I have to, I'm being followed and I gotta get out. But also, it's super crowded. Interesting. Okay, but I gotta find some money, right? Why are we all just chilling? Okay. Then I gotta push people out of the way to get where I need to go. That looks like something. Coins? Heck yeah, let's go. Easy. Yo, Claudetta, here's ten dollars uh, before I go. Here, um, I hope the rest of your stream goes well. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. Thank you, Claudetta. All right, everyone, out of my way. There's a giant guy following me. Pretty sure he's behind me. You behind me? I don't know where you are. I don't know what happens when he gets me, so I'm just not going to worry about it. Uh-oh. He's nearby. He's nearby somewhere. Plenty of cash, though. Get out of my way. Give me those coins. I'll fight you over them. I don't want to get eyes on the thing. Like, where is it? There he is. Nope. There we go. There we go. See, I know what's up. I know what's going on. I gotta be careful with my sprint. It's like, I can get some sprint back, but it's also... Like, it's really slow... Jesus! Brother, you're not playing around. I was like, this is gonna be like super easy to do. Maybe not, just because of like the stamina thing. How much is a ticket? 320? So basically I need to collect three dollars worth of coins. Oh, would you stop it? I wonder if he's hindered by all the people. There we go, 18. <laughs> I like the premise, though. I'm totally lost, however. Oh, I can search under benches? Oh, heck yeah. That's what I was missing. There we go, let's go! Oh, get out of my way! Coin dispenser? Let's go! Jesus, okay, hi. Let's just, let's all, let's all just calm down a little bit, huh? Would you look at that? I'm almost done. Keep going! You walk weird! There's too many people! Too many people! Jesus, get out of my way! Oh my god! This, the game's name is so appropriate. It's like, it is crowded and I'm being followed. Wait, this is enough money, right? Oh my God, everyone move, please. Hold on, I have enough for, for the ticket. Yeah, I, I'm good to go, right? Oh my God, okay. Hold on, I just need to run around and I'm good to go. Hold on, I'm almost there. Come on. I'm gonna cut it close. 
I will cut it close. Also, this is a very crowded area. And I'm so close. Let's go! Let's go! Yo! First try? Nice! That's, okay, legitimately, that's actually kind of a cool game. That is really neat. It's The concept's good, and the execution's actually also pretty good. It's true to its name, though. Crowded followed. Awesome stuff. I was able to get the, um... I was able to get the, uh... uh What you call it? The thing for uh, Techie Techie. So hold up. Let me grab it. Oh, where'd it go? I just had it. Oh, no. I just had it. Wait, where'd it go? Oh, there it is. Gotcha. Yeah, Techie Techie Moonlit Dread That's what this is. I, so I don't know. I'm expecting something big here because you guys are hyping this one up. There we go, got it. Nice. Oh, thanks, thank you, Doma. I appreciate that you like my videos. What else did I want to play? Hold on, there was something else that I wanted to play that I was like, ooh, this is gonna be interesting. Oh, the Crowded Follow, that was up at the very top for itch.io. Okay, no, I'm glad we played that then. For sure, and, oh, and there's, Techie, techie. My goodness. I can't even, like, open my eyes here. All right, cool. I'll probably need more uh, suggestions here in a minute, but that's all right. Let's get this one going. I, I don't know. I'm, I'm expecting big things from this one. Yeah. Whoops. There we go. I feel like this one might be a... Uh... Maybe not. Sorry, just trying something. Oh, now I can do it. Now I got it. Jesus. All right. There we go. Now we're good. Now we're good to go. Now I have a little bit of freedom. All right. Cool. So. Techie techie. Ah, okay. We're going interesting route here. All right. Yeah, it's just my my uh, my live chat froze for a minute, so I was like, "What's happening?" All right, Moonlit Dread, baby. What are we What are we getting into? What's going on? Done. Hey, look, Discord. I think I don't know what this is. Oh, this is coding. Right? Looks like coding. Yo, what's up, decent? How's it going, man? Can I? Oh God, I gotta like. Drag my mouse all the way over. Look at donut. Read. Oh my God, words. Uh, man was found body cutting half near the station of a city. Shocking incident. It's baffled the police. Crime scene was discovered by a passerby. Uh, Axe was involved. Sealed off the scene. Horrible things. What? A ghost of a woman who was cut in half by a train now haunts the station areas. She moves by dragging her upper body with her hands, making a techie techie sound. Okay. 
Cool. So avoid women who have been cut in half who also have a scythe. That's fine. Oh, God, what? Reminder, get groceries. Oh, God, I got to get out of here. Okay. Uh, that's fine. Can I have my donut? Ah, uh, who cares? Get out. Oh, wait. I have to bring the shopping list. Okay, that's, that's fair. I am very slow. Oh, my God. Can I move any slower? Where's the shopping list? And, brother, why am I slow? Okay, so I have the list. So let me just, like, slowly drag myself where I need to go. Is there something wrong? Like, I feel like I shouldn't be walking... Oh, that's much better. What? Oh, it's a train. I was like, is that the techie techie sound? I don't know. Oh, and I can't go that way. Okay. Then don't worry about it. I'm playing as an old person. Well, I got a spring in my step once I walked outside. Now, we're, like, now we're okay. Somehow. Oh, it's actually like it's a full-on little uh, shopping area. Okay. I'm sure the gas station's fine. Like in college and in grad school, like I would often just go to the, uh, um, like the gas station as like my grocery place, you know? You don't always need to go to a Walmart. Sometimes this has what I need. Hi, ma'am. You don't look cut in half and don't have a scythe, so I think you're okay in my book. Get that olive oil. Oh, okay. All right. Get some snacks. Heck yeah. Little uh, little milk. Milk's here? Why isn't refrigerated? Oh, that's... No, put that milk back. That milk has gone bad. You ever leak... Do you ever accidentally leave milk out? It's not good. Hi. Can I help you? Why are you following me? At night, the old woman's tales come true. Run, young man. Okay. I'll, I'll, I'll leave now. Do I have everything? I still need instant ramen. Stop it. Don't walk toward me. All right, since the ramen tea bags this show. Come on, I'm not done. I'm not done collecting all my stuff. You know, it would help if um, all the in-game items actually looked like what they were supposed to. That that would generally help. Let's see here. Where where I'm looking for like more sparkles. Have you heard about the Techie Techie incident? Techie Techie, you mean that urban legend? Yes, exactly. So young, maybe you're not aware. But it seems like the legend has turned into reality lately. It's terrifying. Wait, really? What happened? I don't care! Give me my deodorant or whatever that is. If she appears, you won't escape. Be careful. Maybe I, it's like I have to wait for them to be done. Now I can grab my dish soap. There we go. Uh, tea bags, white rice. Okay. Um, I don't know where it's supposed to be, though. Excuse me? Whoa. Hey. Ma'am? Did I, did I mess up? Are you already victim to the techie techie? Like what? 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 Okay. All right. If I can, if I can just find my stupid white rice here. Oh my god! Why is it so hard to find? Does anyone else see sparkles? Cause I'm, I'm a bit bamboozled at this point. You know, it'd be great if I could ask the grocer for help, but she's gone. This is a little ridiculous. 
Yeah, white rice and tea bags. There should be two more sparkles. Right? What? Are they outside? Like... Hello? Techie Techie? Are there more places other than the 24-7? Doesn't really seem like it. Check the back wall. I I will again. I, I'm just not seeing sparkles. Right? Or do I have to be close to them? It's a bunch of sandwiches. Yeah. We're going to go the classic route. Just keep spamming until you see something. Like, dude, what? Did I break the game? Because, honestly, sometimes sometimes I don't want to break games. Sometimes I want to play. Oh, my. Are you, are you kidding me? You've got. Oh. You have got all right. You just give me that. Hello, I have everything. Since you're not here, I'm stealing it. Need to find the cashier to settle my bill, or I could just leave. Why? Why'd she leave in the first place? In the back. Ma'am! Hey there! Hey, how's it going? What are you doing here? I don't know. Get back to your station. I'm sorry. I came here to settle my bill. I see. Wait here for a moment. I'll be back soon. Wait, here? So please return to the store. Oh, I'm going back. Okay, I was about to say, like, that's about to be... Do you have anything to say about that? No? Just me? Alright, I'll go check it out. Oh, jeez. Hello? I guess I won't worry about it. I have to settle my bill. No? Oh, okay. Well, I guess it doesn't matter. Good evening. I like to pay for these. Easy. 2,750 yen. Excuse me, what's wrong with that old lady? Oh, that old lady's a bit unusual, I think. All right. At night, she often offers, like, to tell strange stories. Strange stories at night. Here's your change. Thank you. And now... The real horror begins. Uh oh. <gasps> Excuse me. Oh. Oh no. Is that what Techie Techie sounds like? A train ticket. Oh no. Oh, I'm still locked in.
Let me out! Oh! I know what techie techie sounds like. Do I don't want to move. Oh! Do I have to go? Do I have to go? Oh, do it! Oh, reminder, hold shift to run. Oh, no. Oh, oh, oh. no way. There's no way. Oh, oh no. Oh, God. Oh, <gasps> no. I don't have any sprint. Oh, I'm almost there. Come on. <laughs> oh, no. Oh. 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 Oh, but brother. Oh, God. Oh, it's no good. Oh, it's no good. She's fast. She's quick. I thought she was going to be like, like a walker that's like cut in half and like slowly dragging. No, she's fast. She is quick. So it may, maybe, um, that was the second ending you got. Okay. So let's do that again. You finished one of the endings, which I continue from the last checkpoint. No, no, no. Continue from the last check. I love games that do this. I love games that are like, hey, you beat an ending, but we can just speed you up so you don't have to go through all the stuff again. Let's just get you to the point where you can get the second exit ending, rather. All right. Which I think I just need to, like, run. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I got to do all this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a train ticket. Yep. Little knock, knock, knock from the scythe, right? There it is. See, she knows too, man. It's boofing time. It, it, it sure is. Get a nice close-up action. I'm assuming, I am assuming that the way I get the second ending is by actually, like, just immediately making a beeline to my house. Like, that's how I win. Yep, there you go. And now time to go. Just beelining. Nope, don't even care. Not even looking. Oh, Jesus. Okay, maybe that screwed me over. I don't know. Because I don't know if there's like a time limit here. I got to go to the back. Oh, that actually might be what I need to do. I'm going to... Uh, am I... Is it... If I die here... I'm supposed to die there. So I have to explore more in the back. Okay. Okay. All right. I get it. Okay. That's why it started me like before all the creepy stuff goes down. No, that all checks out. Okay. Sure thing. Play how to make a cup of tea. I've played that one. Actually, I have a, a video that had that in a three random games. So we're good to go there. I'm trying to remember what the front of the, like what the thumbnail looked like. But it is one of my three random games. Don't go in the circle. Yes, I understand that now. Continue. So we'll, we'll do a little bit of exploring next time. I don't know how, I'm betting I'll have to like go through here, right? Super Mario 
Dolor. I'm not sure what that is. Uh-oh. Did I break it? I was supposed to... Yo, Caleb with the five pounds. Thank you so much, Caleb. Appreciate it. You need to go the same way you went to find the lady. Aha! Okay, perfect. I will do that then. I've requested it multiple times. Yeah, but I don't know what it, it like what is it? Is it a horror game? Like what like what is it? That that's the question. Yo, Big Chungus too. Huge games, man. I thought I, I thought I almost broke the game. I did not. We're okay. How's it going, Di uh, Demon Destiny? Demon Dynasty, excuse me. Boofy Bunker ripoffs, dude. I would love Boofy Bunker ripoffs. Uh, ripoffs. Um, I would play them if they exist. I don't think enough exists. There's only like one true fan game of Boofy's Bunker, and it's it's not even a ripoff. It's like a good game. All right, let's go around. Let's go. Let's, go, uh, let's do a SpongeBob and bring it around town. Oh my God! Stop it. Let's go check out what's back here because this apparently will help me. A car key. Oh. Um, okay, I don't know how this helps me, but okay. I almost feel like I don't have to worry too much about a jump scare because, like, this thing's fast enough, it'll kill me if it wants to. But I'll go ahead and jump in the car and leave that way. Stop it. What, no good? Okay. So I got, not not that car, but I have to take the, uh, the woman's car. That I'm assuming is out front. I know where it is. Yeah, the car, yeah, the car in front of the grocers. There we go. That is, that is unfortunate. Oh, goodness. I have a fun fact, but let me just beat the game first. Oh, 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 I'm alive. Woo, baby. That's. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's one way to do it. Get wrecked. Now, I will say that, like, this would have been a game that would have been fine with just, with just, like, the normal, like, bad ending. You know what I mean? But listen, fun fact. Um, the scythe is actually a terrible weapon. I watched a few videos on it. Um, hold on. There's, there's, a, there's a video made by a dude... Where, who, where's the guy... I want, to, I want to shout out the channel name because it's it's a pretty interesting, like, concept for a channel. It's a YouTube channel where, like, yeah, it's a YouTube channel called I Bought a Field. And it's, like, he's got only 8,000 subscribers, but, like... There's one specific video that came up on my timeline... And it explored using the scythe as a weapon. And it actually turns out the scythe is a terrible weapon. Like, the scythe, a scythe is not a good weapon, to like, at all. Like, it's really meant for what, it, like, like, crops and whatever. Like, if you have to actually try to use it to, like, take someone down, you really can't. And the only way to make it actually a weapon is to basically make it, like, to, like, make it straight, but by that time, but by that point, it's just a spear. <clears throat> Excuse me, a spear. It, it, the scythe is a very impractical weapon if you try to use it for a weapon. But, that's neither here nor there. Oh, gracious me. Techie, techie, that was pretty good. That was pretty good, I liked that. So, 
sorry, I'm super gross. And I have no control over my bodily functions from the neck up. That just allergies are killing me. Um, there's a video that's going to drop probably tomorrow um, that actually explains what I'm allergic to. <laughs> I'm allergic to ash trees. And if you don't know what an ash tree is, you know those trees, like if you, if you ask like a child to draw a tree, they draw the, you know, the trunk and they draw like, it's basically just, you know, it's a basic tree, right? That's an ash tree. That's what I'm allergic to. So I'm allergic to trees, which is a horrible thing to be allergic to. <laughs> to be allergic to a very common tree. <laughs> It's, it's not great. <laughs> I mean, my allergy medication, like, knocks it out, but sometimes I don't like taking it just because I feel weird with it, so. It just dries me out. I'm constantly chugging water. It's just, ugh. Uh, let's see. Wasn't there another... There was another game that... Imagine, <laughs> imagine being allergic to trees. <laughs> <laughs> right? It's not great. <laughs> it's no good. Um Oh, here we go. Uh let's let's play this. Here we go. Here's something called uh Last Night Shift, which is the demo of a game where it looks like I'm working at a motel or a grocery store. Hold on, let's, let's see. I might as well follow the trend, right? While we're doing that, uh, there is a game that I do want to play. Depends on how long it's going to be. Because there's a game called uh, Greg's Deadly Draft, which looks pretty goofy. Yeah, no, this is going to be its own video. Because this is like 30 minutes long. Yeah, all right. I'll play it for like sometime next week. All right, cool. Yeah, it's going to be weird. All right, cool. I'm cool with weird. Hold on. Let me, let me write that down before I forget. All right, cool. All right. Let's pull it up. It'll work with me. There we go. Nice. Where's Sophie? Sophie's probably downstairs sleeping. She's either downstairs sleeping or she is hanging out on her bed upstairs. Another likely location. Game capture, yes. And heck yeah. Oh God, okay, there it is. I was like, I know I, know I got you to work. There we go, all right. Last night shift. And you can tell, like, come on, I've, I've seen this uh, font so many times in horror games. That's a free font. There you go, last night shift. Sam vanished. <laughs> it was like, ta-da, I'm gone. All right. What are we doing? Where are we going? What is this going to entail? This is only a demo, so it's going to be like 10 minutes of what apparently will be a longer game. We're just going to have to see. So I'm getting dehydrated. So I got some water with me. There we go. 
to the office. Okay. So I don't work here. I just, I'm just staying the night. Completed. Enter the office. When did they visit? <laughs> <laughs> it's a great place to stay. I left you some work so you wouldn't be bored. Oh, thanks for your concern, Sarah. <laughs> Any plans for the evening? A date, of course. Ooh. Again. Again. <laughs> so what? I'll find him sooner or later. What? What? Oh, what? <laughs> careful. I heard on the radio that some creep was hanging around nearby. Yes, of course. Bye. Have a nice evening, and I hope that tonight is a lucky night. Okay, so I do work here. Why is your name spelled Sam, S-A-M, and not Sam, S-A-L-M, as in salmon? Well, because the word salmon, I... I, I'm not because my name isn't originally Salmon. You understand that, right, Mango? Like my name is Sam. Right. I'm not I'm not sure how to answer that. It's just how spelling works. Uh take out the trash. Okay. Sure thing. I feel like I should close the door or something. But then again, who cares, right? Get a nice breeze going. It's like a battery because I need that for something. You me? Ugh. Chugging sparkling water can sometimes just give you the burps. Where's the trash? Dark outside. I had <clears throat> oh God! Oh, oh gross! Alex with the one dollar donation, thank you so much. Appreciate ya. I don't know where the oh, I guess take out the trash for like all the rooms, maybe. Room key one required. Hold on, hold on. I saw keys when I was talking to Sarah or whatever her name was. Yeah, see there we go. So one, four, and five. You got it. Bro's burping a lot. I am. And it's because I'm constantly chugging water because of allergy medication. So, look, look, basically the thing is, either I take my medication and I chug water and then I burp a lot, or I don't take my medication, I don't need as much water, but then I, I'm just like gross and I'm sneezing and, and everything. And if you catch me in between, okay, now I'm thirsty and I'm sneezing and burping. So it becomes a whole thing, especially, you know, at this time of year. Oh, there's the trash. I was like, where is it? All right. I already don't like where this is going. It's just doing a whole bunch of chores. Do I have to find a flashlight? Because who cares? The trash, the trash bins right here. Yeah, there we go. Easy. Can I just like walk around? Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, nice. Okay. That makes things easier. Let's probably close that. I got to be responsible, right? Two, three, four. There we go. Thank you. One of these times I'm going to turn around. It's going to be a horrible experience. It's a dastardly person just kind of out here. Yeah. Some creep running around. I feel like bad horror games are just stuck in the 80s. You know what I mean? Like, like every indie horror game plays out like a bad 80s slasher. Like, that's exactly what this one's starting out as. 100%. Hello! Hi! Don't hurt me! You... Oh, goodbye. Oh! <laughs> uh, <laughs> <what>? <laughs> <That's>... <laughs> uh... <laughs> okay 
I got a good look at him. I close my doors. Oh God! <laughs> no way. You no way. <laughs> It was, no, Andrew, you're right. It was getting good in a very goofy way. I didn't really expect the teleportation jump scare. But then right into a thanks for playing. Uh, it would have been, you know, it would have been fun if this was not a demo. Like if this was actually the full game. If this was the game. Oh my God. Wow. I... Uh, Beautiful. Incredible. It does remind me of a game. I've played it before. I kind of want to play it again just to show off in case you haven't seen it. Um, oh, where is it? Sorry, it, you're just going to have to excuse the burps. <coughs> oh, good. Have you guys ever heard of a game called Death Trips? Oh god. It's super short. It's super quick. But man, it is worth it. Have you not? Have you? Has no one ever seen Death Trips? It is one of my absolute favorite horror games. Like short indie horror games is like one of my favorites. And you will absolutely see why. Here, I'm going to play it. I'm going to play. It'll it'll take it's just like 3 minutes. It's quick but it leaves an impression, all right? And I know that I'm hyping this game up, but it's worth the hype, okay? I know some people have seen it, so you guys know what's coming. If I can get it to go, come on now. There we are, there we go, there we go. There we go. Let's, uh, let's get you a nice game capture, head source. And honestly, we need more games like Death Trips. If I can get it to go. Oh, come on now. Is the game trying to scare you? Don't let it. Don't you dare let it. There it is. That's what we want. Little death trips. All right. Here we go. <clears throat> October 31st, 2008. Inspector M. James is in a hunt for a serial killer called Lady Death. The last victim of this dreadful criminal was found in this cheap hotel. Where Lady James is currently investigating. Unfortunately for the inspector, the murderer is still there. Setting up the scene for you. And we've arrived. We're here. We're ready. Okay? Now, no one there at the desk. Better go ahead and take a key. I don't think I need to. And Let's go ahead and shut off the radio. Peculiar how no one's here. I guess I'll go ahead up to go ahead and be on the hunt for ghosts, right? Hmm. Oh no. Oh God. What could have possibly gone awry here? Oh no.
the name of the game is Death Trips. And it is glorious. It is amazing. It's, it is so good. It's so quick. Like, I remember experimenting with this game before. When did I play this? It's like, at least like a year ago. This is back when I first started doing like the three RGs consistently. It's always like, that can't be it. There's gotta be more, right? So it'll let you like go all the way, right? But here's the best part. Doesn't even care about me. It's just... <laughs> it's just... Need more endings for Death Trips? I disagree. I don't think you need another ending to Death Trips. I think this does the job. This is exactly what you want. Yep, thanks for playing. That was it. Perfect. Uh, man. Fan, honestly... It's high quality gameplay there. All right? Death Trips 2. Look, look, that, that's the thing. Like, this game is supposed to be like a one-off funny game, right? A Death Trips 2, it's like, well, it's the same joke, so it's not as funny, but you'd have to really do something with it. Now, Death Trips 2, like, if you were going to make a Death Trips 2, you need to make an extremely elaborate, like, three-hour game that ends with, a like, a joke pun. That the whole game is leading up to, like, this joke pun and then it just ends once it makes the pun, like at a critical, like, uh, um, gut-wrenching uh, cliffhanger moment. You know what I mean? Like that's when it need, that's when it needs to, uh, like, see, that's what would make Death Trips 2 a good game, right? It's about subverting expectations because ultimately it's not a horror game, it is a joke, right? So I would love to play a very serious three-hour Death Trips 2 ending in a pun. Death Trips 2, but you trip? Man, I think that would also do the... Like, I think that would also be fine. Oh, goodness. Guys, give me just a moment. I am going to use the restroom because I, you know, nature's calling. So I'll be, I'll be right back. All righty. I'll be right back. Um, uh, here's a chair. So uh, if you guys get that chair hype, I, that's right. I need to make the chair emoji, like a chair with glasses. Anyways, here. Enjoy the chair. Here, I'll just. Can I just hang that? No. Enjoy the chair. I'll be right back. Be right back. Enjoy the gameplay.
All right. So, so whenever I leave like that to go use the restroom, whatever, I I always turn on my phone. I'm scrolling through, checking Twitter real quick, or checking to see like, hey, how is the chat behaving? How, you know, how's the chair doing? And I always I always see things like, why is Sam taking so long, right? It was a number two. You, you got you gotta just let me let me do my business and be patient. All right. Oh goodness. I did see Andrew suggest that I play suspicious person information, and because they uh, donated five memberships, I, I guess I will listen to their request. I think that's fine. Thanks for the members, by the way. For the member donations. Ooh, can I set you as a full screen, please? I think. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Have I ever, <laughs> have I ever done a smash or pass before? I have not. Probably won't. But that's just me. see here yeah there we go that's what I want backspace there we go suspicious persons information your chair can talk nah impossible chairs can't type I don't know what you're talking about All right. Okay, that was kind of a dangerous throw me into the game. October 14th, Friday, 12:38. So close to the October 4 uh, October 13th. I got very late again today. It gets a little scary around here at night when there are a few people around. I should hurry home. Listen, Japanese horror games do not mess around. Lately, there have been reports of, suspic of a suspic I can't talk anymore today. There have been reports of a suspicious perking lurking around. If you see anyone suspicious, please contact the police immediately. Okay, well, wait! A suspicious person! Wish they gave more of a description. I passed by here yesterday, too. Plot twist, I am the suspicious person. I see a man. He kind of looks suspicious. Oh, I can't pass through here because of the construction. I guess I'll have to cross, right? All right. I'll wait. Oh. God bless you, sir. You. I sense something ominous from you. Please be careful. Well then. Okay. Appreciate it. Wait, what's happening all of a sudden? Something strange? Perhaps. Is it the monk who doesn't fight with weapons? Like a Shaolin monk or something? I don't know. Hey, how's it going? You give me a ride. No? Okay. Rude. I feel like this is one of, it's gonna be one of those like long build up games. Ah! 
I feel like that's a suspicious person. Can I talk to you? You have an explanation or just... Wait, who was that just now? I... I don't know. They were looking this way. It's creepy, so let's hurry home. What? Who is this person? Oh my god. Hey, oh, it's it's right. Reek, re, 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 Rico. Reek, Reek, Rico. 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 Did she work overtime today, too? It's scary, so I'll walk with her. Re, right, Riku, Ryu, Ryuko, Ryuko. Hey, how's it going? What? What, 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 what? What? Huh? Riku? Wonder what's wrong. She seemed surprised when she looked back, but there was nothing there. <laughs> okay. All right, we're gonna we're gonna have to put you, like we're gonna have to put a bell on you, sir, because you, sir, are one heck of a buddy. <laughs> what the hell? All right, well, goodbye. It was that man from earlier. Why is he constantly following me? I've had enough. I want to go home now. Uh, okay. Seems like no one's in the car. Okay. A shot collar and a bell. The bell at least so I know where the heck he is so he doesn't just keep sneaking up on me. He's going to do it again. Like, I think, yeah, I almost feel like the monk is the one who's going to come out of nowhere. It's going to be like a twist ending and, like, the weird dude's been trying to warn me the whole time. Something's fallen. It's the key to Raiko's house. Maybe she dropped it in her hurry earlier. I think Raiko's house was straight ahead on the opposite lane. Nice. Yo, Robert, are you going to keep making Treasure Island vid after Radiant stopped making them? Uh, uh, probably. I've kind of played all I wanted to. I mean, it might be something. I think they're potentially updating the Treasure Island game. But thank you so much for the $10. And then followed up by Revrod with another $10 donation. Thank you both. Appreciate it. Thank you guys so much. Huge help. But it kind of seems like they're going to do an update to one of the Treasure Island games. Or like the original. I think that's what the ending was alluding to. Ryko. Brother. Rude. Please play Dead Signal. I'm not sure what that is. Is that an Itch.io game? Vote out the Hunchback Man. What a bop. Yeah, absolutely. Want to voice act? Well, I, do, I, I am trying to get in, uh, more into voice acting for sure. Raiko! Ryuko! I think it's Ryuko. I'm sorry. Goodbye. Oh, God. What the hell? R Ryuko? She seems to have passed out. From me? I found you? 
I have to run. Goodbye. I feel like I should have just like gone into the house. Did I drop the key? Hey, no, no, no. Oh, goodbye. Nope, I'm at a run. Oh, Jesus. What? When I woke up, I found myself on a hospital bed. According to the nurse, the member of the neighborhood association found me during their patrol and helped me. The man who had been following me was apprehended and handed over to the police, she said. I felt a wave of relief wash over me. I couldn't help but think what might have happened if no one was around at that time. But now it seems I regained my peace of mind and returned to my daily life. The suspicious person warnings will probably be taken down soon as well. Ending A, the culprit is captured, and I did nothing. Oh. God, we're getting a lot of multiple ending games. Not a bad thing, but... Gotta make all the endings worth it. Um, I, I'm assuming that the other ending, like an ending B, would be going into the apartment rather than, um... Like just keep running you know oh enable run for the clear but enable run for me yes thank you game for allowing me to run and like just get going faster yeah heck yeah dude again very nice for it's very excellent for games to give you options to speed up to the point where you don't have to like play through the entire game necessarily right Maybe I still have to do little things and wait and, like, do little parts. But, like, little ways to, like, zoom through to get to the stuff that you haven't seen yet. So that's nice. Don't even care about the monk. Heck yeah. Yeah, whatever. I don't care. I'm not even paying attention. I'm running. It seems like I have unlimited sprint now, which is odd. I'm gonna I'm gonna try uh, getting into uh, Ryuko's house. See if that helps. Don't care about that. The jump, the jump scare is too slow. I mean, I, I guess that's fair. How do I feel about the subscriber count being stuck and not getting to 1 million subscribers? What? What question is that, dude? <laughs> First of all, it's not stuck. It's growing. You just can't see what the growth is because you're not seeing me get thousands upon thousands of subscribers every day. It's growing. You just, you don't see the intricacies of the analytics. Uh, and again, presumptuous of you not for me not to get to a million subscribers. Uh, I mean, ultimately, ah, that was a fake out. That can't actually hurt me. Did I pick up the key? I think I did. I didn't notice. No, you see, that's the thing you wouldn't notice. Like you're like, look, it's I, this, this is worth me mentioning. And this is like any streamer any YouTuber, you do not have to leave a comment of like, hey, how come you're not growing anymore? Or at least, or it's saying like, hey, your videos aren't getting views. Brother, <laughs> we know our views and subscribers and like growth better than anyone. And so if you guys are pointing it out, we already know if something's like off or and, and that's part of the thing of YouTube. Everyone everyone is so skewed to think that, man, if you're not getting like 2 million views a video, you're a failure as a YouTuber, which is not the case at all. People are so blinded by like Logan Paul numbers that it's like, well, if you're not that, then, you know, you're not worth it, you know? Or if like, if you, if you don't have constant crazy growth, 
then oh your channel's dead that's su it's it's such a weird you're not saying that it's your i know i know you're not saying that but at the same time you're asking me hey how do you feel about your your question is whether you meant it or not what was the specific question hold on because i'm what how, what do you feel about the subscriber count stuck and not getting to a million subscribers so it's like you're asking me how do you feel about not growing what what bad i guess like is that what you want me to say you know which also is not true i'm doing fine yeah, I'd like to be growing like Logan Paul, but not everyone's Logan Paul, so no one should want to be Logan Paul. Borderline scammer. <laughs> so he's he's a bad example. All right, let's see if I can jump in here. Can I, like, skip it and just go in? No, maybe not. Okay. <laughs> so I can run in here. Can I not? Or do I now have unlimited sprint? Forget the key. Don't care about the key. Just keep running. So now it gives me unlimited sprint. Okay. Is this it? Oh, right here. The key to the apartment is missing. I must have dropped it. Oh, crap. Oh, well... Hey, how's it going? Such dramatic music. What was that? What? <laughs> Do you see him? He did a wrestling move. He like bounced off like the back post to like <laughs> sucker punch me. What was that? <laughs> I feel like this is just going to be ending A again. Right? Because it looks like I'm I'm found unconscious again. Seems like it. Still a good ending. Yeah, basically. I get knocked out, but it's still, hey, it's a good ending. Is it a bad ending if, if, like, I actually get to my apartment? Like, no matter what, it seems like things actually, like, turn out okay. Yeah, yeah, ending A. Okay, so this time skip, grab the key, and then get out of there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I thought the key that I dropped was uh, Raiko's key. Oh, thanks, Peanut. Uh, yes. What's one video or game series that I'm most proud of? People ask me that question a lot, and one of my favorite favorite answers to that is in the summer of 2015 i had a series called super mario 64 star road i think is what the series was called it was like that's what the game was called and i have like 24 videos uh with one of those videos being like just a massive six hour live stream of like getting all the hundred star coins or the hundred coin stars i just remember having such fun making those videos and just playing that game because it's such an amazing rom hack like some of it's like how much i just loved the game and like at that time i really didn't have not that i didn't have much to do but it was like the last time i had just an enormous amount of freedom and not much to do so i just put in a lot of effort into uh youtubing right and I, and I put, at the time, it was a lot of effort, but I put a lot of effort into making those videos. Now, looking back, you know, again, it's like, I hadn't even been a YouTuber for a year at that point, so I didn't know exactly what I was doing. But it was also like playing through Super Mario 64 again. For the first time. And, like, to be challenged as an adult, you know? Because Super Mario 64 is pretty easy. Super Pokemon Eevee Edition is also another one I loved back then. And am I ever going to return to play Super Pokemon Eevee Edition? Maybe. 
Honestly, maybe, because that is also another fun game. And it finally released the 1.0 version, so the story is complete. And the story actually seemed pretty clever. I'm not going to ruin anything about the story, but that's definitely something you should take a look at if you want to. It's cool stuff. All right, let's actually pick up the key and get out of here. What game is this? Apparently, it's called Suspicious Person um, Information. Want to voice out a character in your show? I, I probably might have to decline because I I would want to know a little bit more about the show and like what I would be voice acting. So maybe that's something you can uh, send to my email for me to take a look at at least. You know. Oh, let me grab that real quick. Got it. We're still good. Now nah, we should be good to go. Bam! Let's go. Too easy. Ending B. The killer is still on the loose. Ha! Huh. What on earth was that? I remembered. That person was the chairman of the Neighborhood Association. What? <laughs> what? I'm sorry, that's a twist. The chairman being the suspicious person? Let's just calm down in my room for now. I need to clean. Oh my god, clean up. Clean up! Are you serious? Brother. Pick up your trash. What does that say? Noise, melancholy, love songs? I, okay. This is a whole bunch of anime? What's, what's the name, what's the name of that, uh, it's a Japanese word where you just perpetually, like, stay inside, like, uh, otaku? Yeah, 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 a young person who is obsessed with computers or particularly aspects of popular culture to the detriment of their social skills. Yeah, so basically what kind of is happening here, right? Kind of almost seems that way. I guess I'll chill in my really gross apartment. Where do, where do you want me to click? Where do you want me to... What is this? What? The day had I eagerly awaited has finally arrived? I was able to get my hands on the masterpiece created by the master of the coveted school swimsuit. Its beauty was like a scene from a French film. As I carefully unwrapped the package, I felt my heart pounding fiercely. The texture of the fabric seemed to take me to an unknown world. Uh... I was captivated by the texture of the school swimsuit. Wait, how can I convey this magnificence to others while well, I can use SFS to, to share photos? Oh, no. I finally made a decision. I believe that by walking through the town wearing the school swimsuit, many people will notice its splendor. I can't contain this feeling anymore. Shining droplets, okay. The radiance seemed to capture the hearts of people. Okay. I, sorry, I didn't know what direction we were going with that. I didn't want to keep reading in case we, like, we went too far down an interesting, strange, horrible rabbit hole, but it, it's just some dude who really likes wearing a swimsuit. Oh, God. It's me. It's me. It's me. I, it's me. I have to let everyone know about this beauty. I'll do my best with the publicity from tomorrow onwards.
I think I was right on the money with calling out the otaku. I am the suspicious individual. Hi, it's me. I'm the problem, it's me. Jesus. What what a twist. <laughs> I'm almost I'm kinda happy that it like ended that way. <laughs> Like, let's just end on some weird stuff, man. Oh, God. All right. <laughs> wow. Okay. Sure. Uh, what is the silk bulb test? This is interesting. This unfinished. Oh, is this playable? So, like, we've played a lot of the games that are, like, at the very top of the itch.io page, but there's something called the Silk Bulb Test, which I think is probably pretty spooky. What's my email? You can, you can search for it um, on my channel page. But, but also, please don't um, be insulted if I don't answer you, because I, I do get a lot of emails on that, on that uh, thing. It's not something I'm, like, regularly, like, constantly replying to people through that email. For, for I mean, for, for good reason. <laughs> um, all right, so, bub test. Which, it's only a demo, but if it's rated high up there, a lot of the high up ones have been solid. Well, except for... Except for the weird um, noodle one. Let's see here. Do you not want to give me that? Oh, come on. That should do it. Yeah, here we go. To be honest, I'm not even sure what this test is. Have you ever considered playing Little Nightmares? I, I have, and I know it's about to drop the third game in the series, right? I, I have played I'm on Observation Duty. I'm not very good at the game at all. All right, Silk Bulb Test. Let's figure out what this is. Calibrating. Please stay in your seat. You got it. Oh, God. Oh, I don't like this. Do you prefer, you prefer the color red? Uh, false. Which one's false? You pressed B. You hate red. B is false. Ah, okay. Interesting. Next slide. Calibration key A, B, A, B, B, B. B. A, B, B. A, B, 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 B. Nice. Sounds good. This is the image of a door. That is incorrect. You are wrong, sir. This is the image of a door. No. These aren't doors, dude. That's a door. I don't know what you're priming me for. You're priming me for something. I've run enough psychology tests back in college. Oh my god! Oh my god.
Oh, I can't press anything? <gasps> I move? No? Today was special. Was it? This is the image of a clock? You're wrong. What? That's not a clock. That's a kitty cat and a dog. That's a clock. Sure. Why not? Sure! That's a clock. That man is not a telephone. That's a telephone. Not a telephone. Nope, just double checking. Not a telephone. It's a nice little family. Not a telephone. That's a person? That's a it looks like a gruff person. That's a person nonetheless. Well, that dog may think he's people, but I'm gonna have to disagree. This game messed you up, legend? Excuse me? That's not the image of a person. You better not be right. That's the image of a person? Wrong! It's an image of people! I regret everything! Yes! <laughs> Calibration. Calibrating. If the aliens could stop breathing down my neck. <laughs> well, you're a whole thing. That's my 98 out of 16. I think that's pretty good. Brother, that's like 400% correct. You kidding me? Let's go. That's not the image. No. 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 Stop it. That's a stranger. Yeah. A big stranger. Unless you show me like just some random Jeff dude. That's a stranger. These are strange people. Don't trust them? I agree with that statement. No, that's fine. You ate breakfast this morning? I, I didn't. Probably should have. Had a piece of toast or something. I, I do often skip breakfast. I'm sorry about that. Just don't kill me over it. Breakfast is overrated. No, it's not overrated. It's good to have something in your belly. You fear making the incorrect choice. Oh, I don't fear... Well, I don't fear it, but this is a horror game. No. I'm going to be petty about this. You should... Oh! Oh, God! I agree. Yeah, no, that's that's fair. You fear failure. I, I fear failure. Yeah. That's fine. I think that's true. You fear being alone? Eh, I like my alone time. There's safety in being alone. Um, I will say false to that. Just from numbers. You feel guilty when you're alone. Eh, sometimes. Maybe I want to socialize a little bit more. You feel alone in a crowd. You are alone. False because of my cat. Fight me. It wasn't a question. Oh. You fear the unknown. Um. No, I don't fear the unknown.
Don't worry, you will. Oh no. Oh, gotta recalibrate. Okay, hold on. Nope, just gotta make sure that everything's okay. Like, hey, are you pressing the right buttons? Okay, we're fine. Just checking behind me. Woo! Man! Calibration complete. Oh, God, gee! Excuse me? How do I make it? Oh. I did it. Hello? Calibration, I'm trying. The hell do you want me to calibrate? <laughs> ah! So I have to click it and then I can Oh my god. Fine. Oh got it. Brother, stop it. <gasps> oh! Oh! What is that? I failed. Understood. Understood. I get it. I, I get it. I understand. I understand. I, I can't mess around with that thing. Got it. So I reset a little bit. <sighs> BBA. Bam! Take that, baby! Restart test. That's a f that you are wrong. You are wrong. Oh, God. Wh what? This application has encountered an error. Please, it's please check its vitals if it's no longer responding. To quit an application, press control to gain. <sighs> okay. Is that it? Is that the end? Why, why am I so jumpy? Did you hear the thing? Did you hear it whispered? Uh, wake up? Did you not hear it? If 
I retry? Oh my god, it's not over! <gasps> no! 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 <gasps> I gotta answer the phone! How are you not over? Oh my god. For the sake of, hold on, that might be an issue. Brother, that creeped me the hell out. Wow. It kind of seems like this was only like a demo of a game. I give up. Oh, man. Holy Jesus. <laughs> Good Lord above. Oh. Need a sec after that. Man. Got, gotta love me some spooks. What time is it? Ah, 7.52. All right, cool. Uh, I'm trying to find like one more like real short one. You know what I mean? Like just give me, give me a nice short one to round out the, to round out the live stream. Something real quick. Oh, here you go. This might be terrible. <laughs> uh, hold on. Let me check something. Lost fear. Okay. No, the lost fear. 10 to 15 minutes. Yeah, let's do the lost fear. Because it's the last one on that that, that top row of itch.io games. That's fine. Do I know Barbie? Like the property? Or do I know her personally? I'm, I'm, I'm aware of the property. Like the movie and stuff? <laughs> yeah, I am. Hadn't Barbie been around like since the 60s? I'm dying inside? Yeah, a little bit. Let's see here. Lost Fear. Let's get this going. Here we are. Oh, Jesus. Wants to start off strong, doesn't it? There we go. The lost... F oh, Jesus. You... You put on a coat. Put on some pants, actually, because, oh, my God. E to interact. You might not have any performance issues, but if you do, high quality is recommended. Beware of your surroundings. He's always watching you. Cool. Awesome. Okay. This, <laughs> this might be a spooky one to get through. This one's really scary. Oh, great. Is this real? Is this real life? It can't be. I thought I woke up, but... This isn't my room. I 
I don't even know what's real. Why? Wait, why does this feel familiar? Have I played this before? Why do I vaguely remember this? Because this is just going to repeat itself, isn't it? Yeah. Have I played this before? I'm going to play through it either way because, like, I don't really remember anything, right? It's just we're going to – it's like PT. It's just going to keep repeating. Where the hell am I? So maybe I've played games like this but not actually played it. Okay, now that's different. Yeah, let's pick up the pace a little bit. Yeah, that's probably a little better. Pretty sure you haven't played this one. Yeah, because it said it came out 38 days ago, but at the same time, are you behind me? Am I in trouble? Or is this a walking simulator? Everything's getting like more destroyed. Do you know the person behind you? Who could that be? Huh, no one? Okay, I don't... Hey, don't be rude. Hey, don't be mean about... Hey, if you're gonna... If you're gonna do it, do it. Hey! Ah, crap. That ain't no good. Oh, stop it. Oh, stop. You butt face! Oh, you butt face! I was waiting for it, too! Oh, I'm in the dungeon. Okay, all right. No, I haven't played this before. This 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 part's super different. All right, you stupid naked demon. I'm gonna find some pants and give it to you because Jesus. I don't know what kind of cryptid you are, but we're gonna fix the whole naked issue, okay? Don't worry, I got you. Ooh, a piece of paper. There are times when all I can think about is murdering someone. Well, that's not great. Maybe if you, if, if you put on some pants, maybe you'll have a different outlook on life. Is that good? I think that's good. Oh, I got it like... Ah! One more to get rid of that, huh? That's what I'm, pr I'm pretty sure. Okay, stupid thing. Trying to make me go through some sort of cryptid SCP. This loser thing. Man. I'm out here risking life and limb. Trying to get through with naked demons. Like, listen, I... I'm out here, down here screaming at nude... Nude people. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, you're a mannequin. I'm not happy about this. I'm, I'm really not. Okay, I can... That's alive. That's alive. Oh, you're not what I think you are, are you? Huh? Okay. <laughs> I hate it here. You gonna do something about this chair? I can't come see you if you if you don't move the chair. Fine. I don't even care. See? What do I care? Well, other than... Oh, I can go backward. Oh, I can. 
Oh, okay. Sure. It's rude. It's fine. It would be that way. <laughs> Why Sam scream like that? Don't you prejudge me. <laughs> ah, it's a clock! What do I what do I do now? Just walk back. What do what do you, what do you what do you want for me for the stupid clock? Ugh. Uh, uh. North, east, west, south. Okay. North, east. West, south, let's go. Let's go. Andrew with the $10, I'm laughing so hard right now, Sam, I'm sorry. <laughs> Look, the clock jump scare got me, okay? I don't know what you want from me, but clocks are apparently are scary when they show up as grandfather clocks out of nowhere around a corner because it's a loud noise and you're kind of, ex actually, hold on, where the hell do I go? Actually, I don't know. But thank you so much, Andrew. Appreciate it. Okay, whatever. Look, I know the thing's here with me. Ooh, what's behind the red door? Ah, the red room. Of course. Of course. Mm-hmm. Seems I have no choice. Do I? Eh? <laughs> oh, hi. Hey. How's it going? Um. No? All right. Well, oh, key. Nice. You didn't do anything about it? Nah. All right. It's fine. Let's not worry about it. <laughs> okay. Yeah, you guys are right. I have not played this before. Like, it very quickly, like, like shook it up. It is different. Okay. All right. So I'm, just, I'm bracing myself here. I can brace all I want. It does not matter. Like, there is no... I, I need... I honestly need a minute. Like... Dude. It's a jump scare simulator, but it's getting me. I think it's the way the thing moves that's, like, creeping me out. Which I really don't like. Oh, God. Okay, there's a chair over there. Can't go that way. Chair. Nope, gotta go forward. There we go. Yeah, see? Why are you getting attacked by a featherless chicken? Brother, I don't know. It's too much Chick-fil-A. That's what's happening. Listen, they gotta get they gotta get revenge somehow. Right? Just revenge of the chickens. Is it weird that I like the sound of screaming? Depends on context. Brother, just do what you're gonna do, my guy. I guess this is Saw. Did 
Don't like that room. Easy. Can't go that way. Oh, maybe I have no choice. Should find something to break the planks, of course. Duncan with the five dollars. Love the content, but will I ever one hundred percent five nights at, five shows at Wario's? Excuse me. Excuse me. Oh my god. Thank you so much for the five dollar donation. Ultimately, that is the plan. Yes. I don't know exactly when I'll do it, but ultimately that is the plan. But thank you. Oh, I can go this way now. Nice. Thanks, moving chair. <laughs> Just an empty room. Why would I say that? You know something's gonna happen. Thing probably broke down all the planks, right? Yeah, yeah, there you go. Oh, it got broken in. Actually, I don't know how this happened because the door got broken from the other side. Oh, light. I like light rooms. Maybe I don't like this room. Never mind. Cutscene. Nope. 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 Mm-mm. Nope. 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 Mm-mm. Nope. 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 I tried. Oh. <laughs> I tried to wake up. Look, I tried. <laughs> Whatever. But now I'm one of them. Soon you'll be too. <sighs> oh my god, it's not over! Now it is! <laughs> Hi, my name is Vasco, and I'm 13, and this game was made in two weeks. Okay. I, okay. See, this is, this is the only time that it's like, hey, you made, there's a good game that was made, and then it's like, oh, you're 13, and now I'm like, now I'm impressed. See, now I'm impressed the 13-year-old made this game, right? Compare this to the 16-year-old who made the Noodle game, right? Y you know what I mean? Honestly, it's almost better if you just stop giving your age because, like, sometimes it's a detriment if, like, you don't have some... Like, all... Like, some people... Like, look, I'm jumpy and people like me are going to like the game because it's like, oh, it's getting me. Other people who aren't really jumpy, it's not a good horror game because it's a walking simulator with, like, easy puzzles, right? So, it's not going to be for everyone. So, I'm not saying it's a great game, but I'm more impressed with this 13-year-old making the game than a 16-year-old give like making the noodle game but at the same time i don't really care what your age is a a anymore at this point you know what i mean or or how long it took to make because people are using that as like a point of pride when they make these indie horror games when most of the time when most of the time they're really really bad so i prefer I, d I don't care how long it takes i don't care how long or, or how old you are I really, I, I, I don't anymore. Unless you're like five and you make like Alan Wake 3, you know? <laughs> but well done on this one. This one scared the crap out of me. Well done. That clock jump scare. That's, that's one for the books. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh. What about an animated series made by a 12-year-old? There's always, there's always limitations there. Part of me doesn't... Look, ultimately, it only matters when the quality ends up being good, you know? Otherwise... It's cool. Like, I'm not saying that if you're 13, you shouldn't be making games. Like, make games. You gotta start somewhere, right? You gotta start somewhere. You gotta be... Here, let me, let me exit out of this and let me... Uh switch over actually 
There we go. Like, if you're going to um, uh, uh, make a game, make a game. You know, I don't care how old you are. But I wouldn't use your age as a way to defend how bad something is or defend how good you feel like something is. Like, hey, I'm only 13 and I made this. No, always be like, hey, I'm like, hey, I made this. And the next thing I make, I'm going to shoot for making something even better. And really, that's the that's the end of it. You know, whether it takes you one week or two years to make the game like you should all be always be striving to improve and do just a little bit better than last time. And that's what I've tried to shoot for with like videos and like any anyone in like the creative space kind of shoots for like that next step. Like what what's the next step to what I am doing now, right? And sometimes it's little baby steps, right? It's either trying something different or adding a different edit to your video or maybe like trying to create a character for your animated series or something that's like a little bit outside of your comfort zone, but as you practice with that character, okay, you get better and then they flow into your story a little bit better. And maybe that maybe that animated series sucks or that character in that book you wrote just is trash and so you learn from your mistakes and then you go to the next one, right? And that learning process happens whether you're 13 or you're 31 or you're 68. That's just how it works. The more you do something, the better you get. And so, you know, if you start young, that's actually fantastic. Start young and start making games. But don't use like, hey, I'm 13 and I made this game and bam, they're like, and that's the end of it, right? And I don't think many people are, but it's the impression I get because like it used it used to be like a fun thing because I think the first person I've ever seen was a kiddo named Christian. And I think he's like 20 now, uh, 19 or 20. But, like, back when he was 12, he made a series of games that were, like, not bad for, like, a 12-year-old kid to th throw together. And they were like, hey, this is pretty good. And a bunch of YouTubers played them, including myself. And we were like, hey, this game is made by a 12-year-old kid, and that's really cool. And that was a point of – that was a point of pride because not many people were doing it. Now everyone's like, hey, here's Sussy Wussy version 3.5. I'm 14. Okay. All right, this is this is the tenth version of that I've seen, but all right, cool. You know, so it lost its luster, unfortunately. You know what I mean? Oh man, I'm tired. I'm tired, but I feel good. I'm tired, but I feel I feel spry. I also need more water Ooh. this is the end of the stream it's definitely going to be the end of the games um it's going to be the end of the games uh for sure i think that was a great one to end on i almost played one that was honestly going to be probably not going to be good like it was a, a five minute game called go to bed but I knew it wasn't going to be great. But it's nice to end on like a solid one. Like a solid short one. You know? One that'll get me. Nab Nab looked different. I agree. Nab Nab was looking quite... <laughs> Nab Nab was looking quite different. I agree. Good God. Trying to put on some like really, really. There we go. There's some just background lo fi. There we go. Man! Play a game called Clock Tower. It's a horror game on the SNES. Dude, Clock Tower is classic. I haven't played it, but I've seen uh, a good amount of gameplay on it. Like way back when. Like a, like a while back. Do I still eat an apple? Dude, I eat an apple every single day for Andy's Apple Farm Chapter 2. I Today I ate an apple. What was today? Today's was number... If you'll give me a second, I'll show you. Today's was number 642. I'm, I was serious about this. I didn't think it would get all the way past 500, but here we are at 642. And I know that the person isn't going to be continuing to work on the game until after she graduates uh, college, which in which is in December for her. So after she finishes college, she's going to continue working on uh, Andy's Apple Farm Chapter 2. And I'm like, heck yeah, we're going to keep going, baby. 
and I've documented it. I've documented it, it on um, uh, uh, Twitter, right? Like I'll I'll have like the clip of me eating my apple, right? So it's all it's all proven. It's all right there. I recommend Do You Copy. How long is Do You Copy? Because I have I've never played it. And I feel like it's one of those, it's like a lot of the horror, like you can't see the monster and it's all just like stuff that you're picking up, right? Is that correct? At least I'm, at least I'm pretty sure, could be wrong. Please play Bunny Graveyard. I know you're gonna have to, you're gonna have to uh, be patient with me on Bunny Graveyard. I keep getting requests like left and right for Bunny Graveyard chapter one because I know it was released like maybe like two months now ago. But other games keep coming out <laughs> that I'm like, oh, I need to play this immediately. It's on it's on the list. Well, it's not currently on the list. Hold on. It's not on my new list. Bunny Graveyard. There it is. <laughs> oh my god. Play Iron Lung? I never actually did play Iron Lung. How long is Iron Lung? Because, I mean, if Mark... Uh, I think it's one of those, like... Win Markiplier. Because <laughs> Markiplier has the movie that he's making for Iron Lung. Which is going to be pretty interesting. Yeah, Iron Lung is like an hour and a half to get through. In total. Maybe that'll be an interesting live stream if we want to do that, like, maybe right before I see the movie. Because I'm, de I'm definitely going to see it. Um, I don't know where it's going to be released. Like, coming soon to theaters. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's going to be in theaters. Dude, I want it, man. I, I would love to one day write and put together a movie that ends up in theaters. I would love that. I mean, it would kind of be, have to be like like the FNAF movie where it's like, it's look, the FNAF movie isn't like the greatest movie of all time, but it's a great movie for the fans, right? So I would want to make something that's like for the fans of something. Um, I'm not in a position to do that, nor do I have the money, you know? It would have to be something that like, maybe like a passion project like I make and then one day hopefully I can uh, put together. It'd be like way into the future. Robert Howell with a $2 donation. Let's go. Thank you so much. Play Babdi? Do you mean Baldi? I'm not sure what Babdi is. But thank you for the $2 nonetheless. Appreciate you. Have I played Dead of Night? Oh, no. I haven't played at Dead of Night. I've, I've seen gameplay, though. The FNAF movie. If you are a fan of FNAF, you will like the FNAF movie. I won't talk too much about it just to avoid spoilers. I did like the direction with what they did, except for the middle part. The middle part gets weird, but overall, solid movie for the fans. You know? Babity is a joke game. I'll look it up. <laughs> I accidentally typed in, like, baddie. I'm like, nope, that's wrong. Babity. Oh, this is a real thing. Okay, hold on. Um... Oh, this looks weird. This actually looks cool. How long is it? That might be something for like next time. So it's one of those. It's like, you got to remind me. Oh, it's like a full. Yeah, it's like a full like 26, 30 minute game. It's like an it's like a weird exploration game. Which. Like light narrative, light platforming elements. So it probably just is horror, but like horror adjacent but definitely like liminal you know that looks cool all right cool uh maybe i will do that uh one of these times next time that might be uh that might be the plan sound good but i appreciate the two dollar donation robert the next time you uh catch one of my live streams like that i'm doing random horror games uh remind me just so it um you know just Keeps me up to date. There are speed runs for this? What? Wait. Apparently you can speed run the game in 27 seconds. <laughs> for Babity. Okay. Play TF2? I've never been a TF2 kind of guy. When will I do another stream? Um, no promises next week. 
or the week after, but probably because like the week. So next week I'll be like preparing videos as we as I go off to Thanksgiving, and then the next weekend is Thanksgiving, and then the week after that's probably when I'll probably be live again. I mean, if I if I get all my work done and get videos all recorded, and next week I'm like, yeah, I have time, then maybe I'll go live, but um, no promises there. Uh, but, uh, not, so it might have to be in December when I go live again or like the very tail end of November, but, uh, we'll see. We'll play it by ear. Does that sound good? Maybe like the very start of December is when I'll go live again on, uh, on YouTube for like a solid, like, you know, put together some FNAF games or put together some horror games or maybe something else if it comes out. Um, I am still going live on Twitch for random things. Um, I kind of feel like, uh, and again, I, I may or may not do this, but I'm kind of feeling... So I have three booster boxes of Pokemon cards that I want to open. Um, so I may do that live on Twitch uh, tomorrow. So if you haven't already, you can go follow me on Twitch. But I mean, I'll definitely continue to live stream on YouTube as well. So if you're like only YouTube, that's totally fine. I got, I got like daily videos coming out for you guys for YouTube. Like I really have a lot of videos that I am trying to crank out just because there's been so many games that I want to play. Like, on my list right now, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven games that I want to play, like, very soon, you know? Including, like, the Boogie Mare Nightmare Mode or Chica's Party World Rebaked, um, like, all max mode, you know what I mean? So, I, I really, really, really want to throw down on some of these uh, games as we go into Thanksgiving, like if you're from America and you celebrate Thanksgiving and then, then the beginning of December. So I have a lot of stuff to play. Hopefully I can get out everything that I want to do um, prior to leaving on my Thanksgiving break. Because I'm going to take like five days off, but I'll still have videos dropping over the Thanksgiving break. But in the meantime, I'll also be like uploading. I've been almost like uploading daily just trying to catch up with all these cool games and I am I am putting my editors to work and compensating them but they are working hard for me so shout out to OJ and DX and Jay he's he's working on one for me right now cool stuff man well I hope everyone enjoyed uh the live stream um I think that's gonna be it till next time again stay tuned I mean I, I got tons of videos coming out on the channel uh, follow me on Twitch if you would like to, and uh, stay tuned for more live streams on YouTube. Appreciate everyone who donated. Thank you. A huge thank you for everyone who donated. And for those who became members this stream, remember, you can click on the join button um, to become a member uh, of the channel, and you get a little nice little cool fish badge next to your name. It increases with level the longer you are a member, and then also you get some cool emojis, which I actually need to catch up on. Um, uh, like like commissioning more emojis right for you guys including a chair one because you guys clearly want a chair one also feel, feel free to give me um, emoji ideas but uh yeah it's caught it, uh, yes being a member does cost money i think i have set it for like two dollars um at the moment but uh but yeah subject to change but i appreciate everyone all righty well I am done for the day. I have my uh, I have my PlayStation right here, and I'm going to play a little Dragon Ball The Breakers. I'm so close to that Platinum Trophy. I'm so freaking close. Uh, but it, it's it's going to be a little bit of a challenge. Well, I'm, I'm going to stay up late playing video games because I've, I've had a three-day weekend because of Veterans Day, you know. I've had a good weekend, and I hope you have had a fantastic weekend. And if you're not having a fantastic weekend, I hope this live stream made your day. I hope I hope it made your evening. I hope I can make your day a little bit better. You know, so that's going to be it for me. Thank you all so much for watching. Please be sure to click on the end cards at the end of this video. If when I put end cards there, hopefully I do. Hopefully I'll, I'll remember to do that. Um, go out there and make someone's day. I love you guys so much. Uh, like and subscribe. What else? If it's your birthday, happy birthday. I'm just copying Cinnamon Toast Ken now. <laughs> uh, be happy, stay happy. Go out there and make someone's day. Be happy, stay happy. There you go. I'll see you guys later. Goodbye. Now get out of my house. Get out. <laughs>